Do you remember the time when customers landing on your website go looking for a contact form for help? And even when they did, they'd have to wait for hours or days for your team to get back with an answer. By the time your team responds, they've already closed their tabs and walked away from your website. What if your customers didn't have to go looking around for help? What if you could deliver answers for frequently asked questions right where they are on your website? What if your support team could just focus on the questions that haven't already been answered? You can do all of this and more with the Freshdesk Help widget. You can deliver contextual help for your customers on your website. Your customers no longer have to wait for your support team to respond. They can quickly browse through your solution articles and get all the answers they are looking for. Let's set up your first help widget. First, go to your admin section and navigate to widgets under support channels. Give the widget a name for your reference. And optionally, link it with a product from your Freshdesk account. Any ticket created from this widget will be automatically associated with that product. Once you've picked a name and a product for your widget, you can start building the widget. You can show just the contact form or solution articles and a form. When you enable the form, you can show a simple form or all the fields set up in your account. For self-service, you can pick relevant solution article categories and associate them to the widget. The widget will display the most viewed solution articles from the categories that you've picked. You can also choose to show specific solution articles based on the web page your customers are on. Even if you have comprehensive solution articles in your knowledge base, your customers may often reach out to your team even before reading them. By choosing the Optimize for Deflection approach, you can hide the contact form when your customers open the widget. The form will only show up when your customers mark a solution article as not helpful. Once you've set up the basics, you can customize how the widget looks using the Appearance tab. You can choose a gradient or a solid color for the banner. You can also choose a color for the buttons in the widget. After you've set up the widget, use the embed code on your website to go live with it. You might need the help of your developers to get this up and running. If you use Shopify, WordPress, or Wix for your website, you can use plugins to embed the widget on your site seamlessly. You can find more details in the description. Once the widget is live on your website, your customers can use it to read solution articles and get answers to their questions. Go ahead, try out the help widget and tell us what you think.